Hello Agnes, uh, Nith here. Uh, I did try to make a video for two times, but suddenly something always got missed. So this is third time making video. I think this is last time. <laughs> so I don't know if we can get it. Uh, let's do it re over again and uh, let's do the packet tracer and let's start over. Mm, I hope you get it this time, <laughs> cause it's not not that easy. So. Yeah, um, let's just keep going and let's let's do whatever we're doing. So let me go ahead and put this on guests. For you, you need to do it yourself because this is not an easy task. And uh, let's go ahead and put the IP configuration for PC one one seventy one sixty point twenty point uh, ten, and then this one is two five five point two five five point two five five. Point one two eight and this one also one seven two point sixteen point uh, twenty point one. This is gonna be desktop. So we're done the first part already. <laughs> now for the second part, let's go to your desktop IP and then let's put the second IP one seven two point twenty point sixteen point one thirty eight. We're gonna do two five five point two five five point two five five point one twenty eight again. And this time it's gonna be gateway will be different, which is 172.16.20.129. And we are done this too. And now let's go back to your let's set up the R1 router now. So let's go back to CLI. Let's do user pass verification, which is Cisco enable. And then we're gonna say class. And then we're gonna say config T. There you go. Now we're gonna put uh, interface interface g0 slash 0 now we're gonna put IP address which is gonna be uh, 172.16.20.1 and because of another server so mask is 255.255.255.128 two enter so we got this and we're gonna say no shutdown no shutdown and we got this open now and now we're gonna do pc2 we're gonna say exit here and then we're gonna start again so interface so we're gonna now g0 slash one i think let me get to the point there Right, so now we're gonna do Jesus slash one, which is not that easy task. So let's go ahead. Now IP address is one seven two point sixteen point twenty point one two nine, which is gonna be a gateway for the uh, PC two. Um. Uh, And then we're gonna do is uh, we're gonna add the server mask 255.255.255.128 still the same okay and then we're gonna say no shutdown and that is open again now we're gonna set up the last one we're gonna say exit here and then we're gonna say um, interface S0 slash 0 and slash 0 IP address 209.165.200.225 and then the and the server mask is same 255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.
and now we have to do PC3 and PC4 now we're done that and let's close this and to check it let's ping it and uh, to do that let's check it out so we're gonna ping 172.16.2 138 and there you have it it's pinging already and we received a message request timed out and and it will okay something wrong now at 172 we try to ping uh, nothing happened what's going on here let me search PC2 up the configuration 172.16.20. Okay, so this one is 2.16. Okay, sorry. And this one's gonna be 20. So now, now we can ping it because I made it wrong. 172.16. Okay, so now we did it correctly. So now let's ping it. Now we can ping. So one, so ping one seven two point sixteen point twenty point one thirty nine. I'm sorry, one thirty eight, and then enter. And then if we ping that, um, let's see if the message arrive. And there you go. So now it's pinging. So it's done. Now we're gonna ping PC one, and let's figure out how to do PC one. So ping. But not here so let's forget about this let's go to pc2 and let's do the 172 ping 172.16.20.10 and it's already pinging so there's nothing to worry about now and it's like pretty good and now let's ping from the router i'm sorry from the uh, hold on let me check what is going on here so we did the 172 129 the ip address okay which is good we did everything right and now we're gonna do ping here and desktop let's ping uh we already got these so we don't need to worry about that and now let's go to r2 and uh, let's fix this now now if, if we can just uh, we don't have to type it all over so we can just put 64 there and uh, and then we just need to go down there and let me see now let's get the pc3 ip address which is this up to a copy it control c you can't put right click and then put there is control v and we got that right and then we're gonna put <laughs> subnet mask which is this one control c and then put there and we're done that now we're gonna do our next one let's go to pc uh four PC4, let's go ahead and put the desktop and IP configuration. We are gonna do the same. Desktop copy the PC4 here, the Nick card, and it's gonna be 13 this time, so it's still gonna be slash 64 at the end. <laughs> so let's put slash 64 and gateway is, is gonna be same, so just put the same gateway here so we can ping it. And then once we've done that, we're gonna do the same for the next, but this time it's gonna be a little different because we are going to do something different this time <laughs> so we have to activate these so last time we put ip only this time we're going to put ipv6 so let's go ahead let's start this cisco uh, enable and close and now we're going to say config t and then we're going to say uh, interface um i think it's going to be g0 slash zero i think yes so interface we're gonna put this IP address on interface so we're gonna say copy control C and then go down here and type here G 0 slash 0 and then come down then put IPv6 address and then control V maybe it's not gonna work here so we can just right click there and then there is our control V IPv6 address and there's no subnet mask for that so we're gonna put here enter it says incomplete command so feels like we did something wrong again so incomplete so let me do one more time IPv6 address 2001 
Oh, okay, we do need this. Okay, we do need this. Okay, so let's take this uh full. Okay, let's try to take full here. Slash 64. Okay, so we do need slash 64. I say so we do need slash 64, Agnes. So let's go ahead and let's put no shut down here. And it's already turned green. Now we're gonna say here, we're gonna say exit. Uh, my bad, exit. And then we're gonna say same. We're gonna do config t again. All right, we are already config. So okay, so interface interface. Then we're gonna do g zero slash one. So it's gonna be different. So g zero slash zero slash one. And we're gonna put ipv six address again. And we're gonna copy this whole part here control c and uh, right click on here paste it and we're gonna say enter they're gonna say no shut down and that's also done so now we are on the last part which is say we do a serial so which is ip can ip configuration which is gonna be interface so interface interface uh s0 slash 1 s0 sl slash 1 so i think it's slash 1 now we got wrong 0 slash 0 slash 1 okay and then we come down here we're gonna say ipv6 address and it's gonna be this one the last one we don't need to put link so because we already linked it doesn't even told us to do so or maybe we can because it's not gonna help us anyways we can try but it's not gonna work anyway so we can try here and enter and it work and we're gonna say no shut down and we got everything right here exit now we're gonna try this if this doesn't work it means that it's not gonna be in it so let's try to put that so interface l in interface link then let's put question mark if it says here nope we can't do that because it's not interface so we nope still not so it means nothing there so we just want to say exit sorry okay we already exited so okay so all right we don't need this anymore and we done the first part and now let's go ahead and check the pinging part here and uh, we go over here r2 now we are going to the server again and then we're going to fix that let's go to ipv ip configuration is already here we're gonna search this ip address if this can ping it so let's go back to the um, command prompt we're gonna say ping here and then we can say control v and there you go and let's see and it's pinging so that's it for today uh that's it for uh, 1.1.3.5 .1 this is for first lab and uh, i got really tired now i just came from work and <laughs> really tired i think uh the rest uh, the next one is a little bit harder because i don't really remember the notes for that so first time let me First, let me see how we can do the next one, which is 1.4 version. Then I will make another video for you, Agnes. Until there, please do this, and I'll and and see you there. And have a great night. And uh, I hope you feel better from your fever. Eat medicine and uh, wait for my next video. Bye, and good luck.